Now you saw about the Thales theorem in our audio video. What you want to look over here is the converse of the basic proportionality, okay, or the Thales theorem. Just to recapitulate what does the Thales theorem say. The Thales theorem says that if one of the line is drawn, okay, let's say you have line BC over here, you draw a line which is parallel to BC, which intersects the other two lines of the triangle at point D and E, then in such a case, this line divides the two lines in the same ratio, or in other words, the ratio of AD is to DB is equal to the ratio of AE is to EC. Now when we say the converse of proportionality theorem, what we mean is, as a result, what follows is that if, if in a given triangle AD upon DB is equal to AE upon EC, okay, we're not assuming that these two sides are parallel, but when we get the ratio of these two respective lines and they are proportionate, then it implies that DE is actually parallel to BC. Right? So that's what the converse of the basic proportionality theorem says about. Now let's look at one question which we have designed in this particular case. Here it says that if AD in this particular triangle is equal to 3.4 centimeter, so 3.4 centimeter, DB is equal to 10.2 centimeter, AE is equal to 2.7 centimeter, and EC is equal to 8.1 centimeter, prove that DE is parallel to BC. Right? Now, if DE is to be parallel to BC, which is what we spoke about, okay, if this has to be parallel to this line, then ideally, what we spoke over here should be true. In other words, AD upon DB should be equal to AE upon EC. Let's see if this holds true in the present case. What is the value of AD? AD is equal to 3.4 centimeter and DB, DB is 10.2 centimeter. Right? If this holds, then this should be equal to AE, which is 2.7 centimeter divided by EC, which is 8.1 centimeter. Right? If you just remove the decimals, both over here and cancel out these centimeters respectively, what we get is 34 by 102 should be equal to 27 by 81. Now if I divide 27 by 9, we will get 3 and if I divide 81 by 9, I will get 9. 3 goes into 9 3 times, so 1 and 3. So the right hand side actually becomes 1 by 3. To make things simple, if I just divide 102 by 34, ideally I should get 3. Is that the case? 102 divided by 34. 3 times 3 times 4 is 12, 2, 1 carry, 3 times 3 is 9, 102. Right. So 1 by 3 is equal to 1 by 3. Since the ratio of these two sides is equal to the ratio of these two sides, we can conclude that DE is parallel to BC. You are going to use this particular theorem in a large number of problems that you would see going forward. We hope you had a good time hearing this. Thank you for being with us today.